Curtis Brian, sources say that threat was first posted to Facebook and then parents quickly got the word to the police who jumped to action quickly to make sure that nothing happened out here. Oh, I'm very scared. I mean, it really surprises me. Honestly, it's extremely frightening because I do have two daughters. Parents on edge tonight after learning that police removed weapons from the home of a teenage student at Utica High School. That student, according to police, saying kids should wear red next week because there would be blood. Parents initially told police about the alleged threat after a school drama performance over the weekend. Parents just need to stick together. Like you said, a parent called the police and that's what we're supposed to do. If we see something wrong, we're supposed to report it. Police say they have taken precautions and are in contact with the student and his family. They say a formal arrest has not been made just yet, but their investigation is still underway. Police telling us they remain committed to ensuring a safe environment for all kids and staff. Utica is so small. I mean, it's never been a problem. I've never been I've never been scared about it happening there. And really with everything going on in the world nowadays, I mean, I say my prayers all the time and I really thank God that nothing never really hit home. In a statement to Action News, a spokesman for the district says there were rumors of inappropriate comments made over the weekend. He says we worked with Shelby Township Police and school will be open tomorrow and they are taking necessary precautions so students will be safe. Police also telling me there is no way that that student will be back here tomorrow. Live in Shelby Township, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. Back to you.